Right, hi everyone, I'm going to be talking about some of my favourite movies um, in a new series but about this. Um, one of my favourite movies is Spartacus. Um, it was released in 1960 uh, by Stanley Kubrick and it was um, sort of produced by Kirk Douglas as well. Um, this is one of the great epics of the 1960s. Um, it was shot in 75mm I think um, as well. It is a great movie. It's one of my favourite movies. It stars uh, Tony Curtis, uh, Gene Simmons, uh, Laurence Olivier, and uh, many others in this movie. I think it's such an incredible masterpiece. And I know it's been released in America in 4K, which has been pretty good, but I hope it gets released here in Australia soon. And the cinematography in this movie is absolutely amazing for its time. I mean, it's made for widescreen movie. It's a widescreen movie. And Cinerama, the, the version of Cinerama version, is worth seeing it, you know, on the big screen like that. And um, yeah, the Universal have released it again in 4K. This is, you know, a great version to go and see it. Um, I think it was released back in cinemas for its re-release in, like... 2015 I think it was and they did another uh, master to it and yeah it is one of my favourite movies I just love it the cinematography is absolutely incredible the story is good even though it goes for 3 hours and 35 minutes it's still a great epic movie and a great masterpiece uh, at the end where they go and I am Spartacus and then Spartacus dies on the cross um, with Tony Curtis's character of uh, Leonidas I think yeah, such a great movie. There's also the love story between him and uh, Jane Simmons' character as well. Um, and such great elements to this movie. Um, even Peter Euston of in it as well. And he plays a slave owner. who loses most of it and loses most of his power and all that too. And loses the slaves in their uprising. So it's also a movie about slavery as well. It took place, you know, more than 2,000 years ago. And the elements to this movie are just so good. Um... They added a scene on the Blu-ray of um, <clears throat> Into Ninus, Tony Curtis's character, with Laurence Olivier's character. But they lost the track to this and they replaced it with Anthony Hopkins instead. So Anthony Hopkins is actually the voice of this part in the movie. Um, <clears throat> I think it might be in the 4K version of this movie as well. But you can pick it up. You can pick up um, Anthony Hopkins' voice in it and not... Lawrence Olivier's voice, you know, with Tony Curtis. So it's weird that they, they have that in that movie. Um, I do love this movie, and I hope to get the 4K soon here in Australia. It's just a great movie. I love it.